This map shows the situation in Eastern Asia in 1931. Here is Japan. Most of Japan is covered by high mountains. There's little farmland to grow food. In the 1920s, Japan depended on importing food from China for its growing population. Japan did not have raw materials such as iron ore and coal. These were imported from China. Japan also imported raw materials from Korea, which it had already conquered by 1931. Japan also leased the Kwantung Peninsula from China. Japan got most of its food and raw materials from the Chinese province of Manchuria on the South Manchurian Railway. This railway through Manchuria was built by the Japanese and was controlled by the Japanese army. It carried Japanese goods into Manchuria and the rest of China and brought food and raw materials such as iron, coal and timber back to Japan. The worldwide economic depression hit Japan very hard. Army leaders in Japan decided that the solution to the problem was to carve out a Japanese empire by force. In 1931, Japan invaded Manchuria. By February 1932, they controlled the province. They renamed it Manchukuo and set up a puppet government there. Later in 1932, the Japanese bombed the Chinese city of Shanghai and then attacked it by sea. This was followed by a full-scale invasion of Jehol province in February 1933.